Hello everybody. Hope everyone's well. Welcome back to Cooking with Brenda and David. Welcome back to Appalachian Cooking with Brenda and David. Some of it is and some of it ain't okay. Okay, uh, what, you? what I'm going to make now is going to go with what's coming, okay? So you'll see what I mean. <coughs> I'm doing a video on something, but I need some mayonnaise and I'm out. So instead of running to the store, I'll go ahead and do this. I was going to do it eventually anyhow. So this one, the other one will kind of connect onto it, I reckon. So I need some mayonnaise, and you need you need a cup for what I'm going to make. I just need a cup. What, are you going to try to make mayonnaise? Yeah, I'm not going to try. I'm going to do it. Oh. <laughs> I'm not going to try, dear. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to get some ingredients ready here real quick. I'm almost ready anyway. I'm going to use my little stick blender for this. Well. So what are you doing? I mean, you're not even saying what you're doing. I, I see a. I see a bottle of kerosene here, and. You know what that is? A bottle of kerosene. So. <laughs> so I was just measuring out some salt, and I'm going to need that again in a minute. All right, I'm going to make some mayonnaise, y'all. I got a jar, and I'm going to use the wide mouth one because I didn't get, get anything that came with this. I wonder if the cordless one works as good as this. This, it's a stick blender, in case you don't know. I'm sure David don't know what it is. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is, I'm going to put an egg. One egg. Okay, I got one egg. <coughs> oh, I need a teaspoon on that one. No, I don't. Because I'm only going to make a little bit. Okay, this is a half a teaspoon of salt I'm going to put in there. And let's make sure I'm not going to put too much of that. That's fresh lemon juice. You use what you want. You can also use vinegar, whichever one you want. Okay, it's really better if you use the dark one. <coughs> but uh, that, you don't have to put it with the mothers or whatever. So that's all I need of that. And I'm going to put just a little bit. About the same thing in honey, about a teaspoon. I like it with the lemon juice. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to put the same thing, a half a teaspoon. It probably won't end up to be a half a teaspoon because half of it's going to be on the spoon. I'm going to eat it. Okay. Well, we also need about the same thing in a Dijon mustard. I'm not making a lot, so I should have just went ahead and made a lot now. We're going to put this down in. I'm going to also, they say, I've heard that it won't thicken up if you do it this way, but it does. What's in the cup? Olive oil. I mean, it's canola oil. Canola oil. Some of it's on the table. Save it. Okay, leave it down close to the bottom, okay? And we'll try to... Don't you see what I'm doing? You see it changing? Now give it a few seconds on the bottom. It's doing that edge, what it's doing. Isn't that cool looking? Let you see what it's doing there. Now, just bring it up. Leave it in there for about 15, 20 seconds, okay? And now mix it in good. Mix it up good. What do you think, David Hall? <laughs> huh? So now you know if you, if you need to run to the store and get some mayonnaise, if you have these ingredients, you don't have to put the... You don't have to put the... Um, Honey. Was that a special mustard or something? It's just D, John. You can use regular. Oh, you can? A lot of people use this regular. I like that. Kind of looks like... It's like anything else. You don't want to over mix it either. Looks like glue. 
Mm, tastes like mayonnaise. <laughs> Let me try a little bit of it. I'm going to stick my finger in it. Get it off the blade, but just be careful. Yeah, it does taste like mayonnaise. <laughs> it sure does. Get a miracle hat in here today, ain't it? It does taste like mayonnaise. Huh. I told you, he's never in the kitchen. <clears throat> over the years, you always learn all kinds of stuff, you know. You learn how to do all kinds of stuff. Well, that was pretty simple to make. It was very simple to make in less than five minutes. So, okay, y'all. We'll be back in a little bit with the other video. Okay, okay well, what's, what's, what is what what are you going to be making? I'll tell it when I come to it. Mm -hmm. That's what I needed this mayonnaise for. All right. You wanna... I just told you, David, it was chicken and noodle casserole. Oh, it's a chicken and noodle casserole? Yeah, but I needed a cup of mayonnaise, <clears throat> so I'm doing two videos for it, okay? I like anything with chicken in it. Okay, well, we'll see you in a minute, folks. All right, let's do the rest of the video. Okay. Now what what are you making? A chicken casserole or something? I'm making a chicken and noodle casserole. That sounds good. Let me good. mix it out just in case something got in my bowl. In my bowl. It smell it. What do you say? It seems seems like it's good. You'll love it. It's the homemade mayonnaise. It'll be something like a pot pie without the crust. Excuse me. If I could get going on this would be. Oh, he likes my homemade mayonnaise. He's I don't. He don't never know about nothing like that. <clears throat> All right, I've got my pasta. I done them yesterday to get ahead. So I don't know if that's too much or not, but they're good. They'll be heated up and all. That's a little stuffing or something from the Leave other it day. Alone. From the other day. <laughs> <coughs> don't tell my secrets yet, okay? All right. <laughs> You're over here eating my ingredients, dude. Get well, over young somewhere. Okay, just stay over yonder somewhere. All right. This dish might not be big enough. Better be for all them noodles. You're supposed to cook a whole bag, and I did. Let me get them <coughs> in. They're sticky. That's good. That's good pasta when they're sticky. Means it's real old. It's been laying around for a few weeks. <laughs> <laughs> what a ding dog. It ain't been. Well, it's probably been around for months now at a time. Huh. Months at a time. Me and him, we go out and we buy all kinds of stuff and look right there under the table. We've been at it again. And well, we bought some canned goods. I, I mean, think it would be. But we're going to try to do some canning. You got a bunch of canning jars. I'm going to do some canning. So, I don't have a bunch, but I. I bought you, you some. You know, the other night I told you to remind me. I can't remember nothing. He told me that. Um, I'm trying to think of t tell you something. Now I forgot what I was telling you. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I think I got them undone there enough. I made my mayonnaise. I need a cup of mayonnaise. I need two cans of this. So what I'm going to do is get me a bowl. You forgot what you was going to say just because I wanted you to move over just a little bit? No, yeah, because you interrupted me. I know, I just hey, want you to Hey, if I can think of it at all, don't interrupt me. For God's sake, don't interrupt me. <laughs> or for goodness sakes, don't interrupt me. <laughs> that would not be good. All right, what's them cans you're opening up? Cream of chicken soup. Cream of chicken soup. All right. Okay, I need a bow, and I need one more thing, Daddy. One more thing. A cigar. Yeah, I'll take a cigar. Put a cigar I in there. I used to smoke, but I'll tell you, them black and miles, I like them. And I'd afraid the smoke one, I'd probably want to keep on smoking. I don't smoke no more. It's been a long time now. I'm so glad I quit. Thank goodness. I know. Your brain's already fogged up. I just heard on a TV show, it said, don't, that, don't too many people. Uh, Did you hear me? Huh? Show what I said? My brain's fogged up. <laughs> I can't wait. All that smoke. Yeah. Well, it got you didn't smoke cigars, you dingbat. I smoked a black and mild every now and then. I know, then. but I was talking about them old big stogies. Oh, a great big old cigar? No. I need to get my bowls, David. You're in the way. Your big tail out of the way. It's big enough now. What I'm going to 
to do is I like to rinse everything out. Even it had the lids on them. But yeah, it don't hurt because we got some new critters now. We we don't have the ants no more, but we got some new critters called a panty moth. Pantry moth, and you know what? Um, somebody and said we never oh, had them. Just, we never had them things before. Somebody said they just fly in, but you know what? I don't know about that. So they called a panty moth. Look, I got a quarter of a cup of onions here. Uh -huh. This recipe does not call for no onions, okay? I like to put just a few because it's a sweet onion, and oh my goodness, they can give the best flavor. Just a little, that was just a quarter cup, and it wasn't even full. Okay. Just to give it a little flavor. I didn't put no peppers or nothing in it. Okay. Okay, I'm going to put... Put sugar in it? You need to buy the... I'm going to... Well, I don't know how many of these I need, but you see this... Um, <clears throat> um, you need just peas and carrots or you can use mixed vegetables it, I'm not going to stand here and pick out a cup of peas and carrots but sure I should have hmm. you don't need very many okay. probably a cup that ain't quite a cup and you can also put a little corn now that's probably about a cup. I'm gonna mix it in in a minute. I What's think that? I need a deeper bowl, don't you? I don't know. I don't know nothing about it. I'll be right back. That's is that that mixed vegetables in a can, or did you mix them up or something? No, they were they were frozen. Oh, the frozen. Okay. But look, you don't have to buy. It's cheaper to buy a can. I'm sure you can buy a can and um, drain them and rinse them off. It'll be just fine. A can of peas and carrots is really all you need. Okay. Or you can use the mixed vegetables. It doesn't matter. Okay. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I got it back on. Did you want to wait until you got that done, or you? No, it doesn't matter. What Either are you doing? Way, I'm gonna have to dump it in this bigger bowl. I got a deeper bowl. Oh, you made too much. No, it ain't too much. But to me, with whatever else you got to put Here. in it, it will be too much. <clears throat> I'll get the dirties over there from them. I'll have dishes to wash. Okay. You know, you don't need that many of those vegetables. Just enough to go through it and look pretty like a pot pie, I reckon. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. Just set it outside and let the rain wash it. It's going to rain tomorrow again? Yeah. Good time of day. Where am I going to get my stuff done out there? I don't know. I don't know April either. showers bring May yeah. flowers. Yeah, some pretty May flowers, too. I mean, did you flowers you got planted yet? None yet. None? I thought you had some already. Oh, I, ha I haven't got any of the ones I just bought. But you yeah. got some other ones, yeah. Yeah, I've got some going. I've got some planted. Okay. Okay. Now, <clears throat> I'll deal with those in a minute. All right. Now, let's mix these ingredients like this. Two cups of this. Now, look, I'm not going to put any salt in this because there's salt in the mayonnaise. And you can tell that little half a teaspoon of salt is salt. It's plenty of, plenty salty. Well, we talked about it off camera. I thought it tasted okay, but you thought it could be just a little less than a the salt. A little less salt, but... Okay. So, I'm not going to add no salt because you got salt in these cans right here. But the mayonnaise tasted all right with me, but you thought it could do just with a little bit less salt. You can make your own honey mustard. It's real easy. And you know... It says honey mustard, but all you really got in it's a teaspoon. Mm -hmm. A little bit of that, a little bit of mustard, and a whole lot of mayonnaise. You can make your honey mustard if you got honey at home. Mm -hmm. Some people keep honey at home. I do, because I put it in my tea. I think everybody should keep a little that honey at home. That's my cup of mayo. Ain't that cool? That would, I, I, I thought you knew I could make that. I made butters uh, when I was a kid in a churn. I used to make butter. Well, and now I need one cup of milk. I'm going to put a little bit of pepper. You know, you could buy some of these boxes of milk or powdered milk and stuff like that. If you wanted to buy a few things ahead, that's just an idea. I've got some powdered milk and i got some of my little boxes too. Oh, I should have used the rest of this one. Huh. Okay. It's 1%, but it, I said... My mom and them gave me some of them boxes, and I'm like, I don't know why they gave them to me, because they, um, what I'm doing, I'm going to mix all this together, because it'll be easier, and I also, I also got to put the chicken on there. 
Well, that was that government milk they gave to your mom, wasn't it? Yeah, they, but, yeah. but they got it all over the place. You can even buy the almond milk. She gave us a In can a of uh, beef one time, that government beef. I got several cans of it. Man, that stuff's good. I like to have me some more of that government beef. It, it was good. I raised noodles and rice. I didn't see a thing. But, you know, I don't know if it's poison or not, but it's, it sure does taste good, though. Stick your finger in this mixture and see what it tastes like, dude. It ought to be good. Your hands don't. are clean, right? I doubt it. Oh, no. You doubt it and you did that anyway? Stinking yeah. David? No, it ain't bad. No, I washed earlier. I know you did. I hope you washed before you eat. I did before I put that brace back on. And you was eating chips and cheese ball or something, weren't you? Yeah. Yeah, that oh, okay. is good. That's tasty. Whatever okay. it is, it's a mixture of goo, but it's good. Tasty. A mixture of goo. It's you said good. you weren't going to put no more salt. That ain't salt. It's oh. black. Pepper. You normally don't there put no salt. There is white pepper. Just a little bit for flavoring. I was wondering when that's that going. That goes to chicken. I know. That's the best part. That's not all of the chicken, but that's some of the chicken. If I, bring, if I cook a chicken, but this one was $5.09 at the deli reduced it, and I got it, and of course him. That was already cooked? Yeah, but hey, I couldn't, How did they cook I couldn't it find a whole chicken as cheap as I bought that one. How did they cook it? Is it Rotisserie. A, is there a way, special way you got to cook it for this I recipe? Or, or are you supposed to boil it or put it in a rotisserie? Or? It's already cooked. They cook so you don't use fried way. chicken? No, I don't. I guess you could if you want it to. Well, that's the question I'm wondering because people might want to know. Do you Can you put Kentucky Fried Chicken in there? Or, you or, want to. I'm sure it will flavor that Or does that it have to be good. deli chicken that's been reduced? Would sure flavor that pretty good, you know it. Now, well, let's get this thing going. Bake at 350. I've got to clean that now and this. i got to still level that thing for you, too. I, I know a chance. you do. I can't believe it, you sorry thing. Hey, guess what? I didn't mean that. We carry on like it all the time. He's not sorry. He's a hard worker. David is really a hard worker. I'm so tired I can't even hardly stand here right he now. He and I both work at the same place. You didn't have no choice but to work hard. Well, I worked in a warehouse. He delivered, and then I went in customer service, and he went in the store doing his thing. Had to come a long ways to work, and killed you every way you went about it. Now you just pour it. Some people might heat this up before you put it, but you don't have to. Just easier, though, to mix it all together before you pour it on here. Get all that out there. Mommy used to always say, get all that out. I don't know what you're hinting at. I'm not. I'm doing like this. I'm trying oh, to. Oh, he's always moving, and he'll say, "Well, you didn't do what I told you. What you do?" No, I, we don't script nothing, honey. You know that. No, we don't script nothing. But I'm just my hand is hurting me, so I'm just waving my hand. No, but you'll do stuff, and you expect me to know what you're doing. So I'm saying. And plus, I need a haircut. I look like a hippie. I'm gonna give you a haircut tonight if you're a good boy. If you're grumpy, I won't. I'm just going to let, if you're not going to cut my hair, it's been so long, I'm going to grow a big old beard and let spiders build a nest in it. Look, y'all, you're supposed to take the chicken, and I, I was only a small one, but that's okay. It's enough chicken in here. He had two sandwiches, and Spaz had him two or three pieces. That's the I kitty. always save the bad one that I don't want, you know, for Spaz. He gets the good one, too. Who am I kidding? Now, I'm going to tell you... He's looking off for puny. We're going to have to take him to the bed, I believe. I don't know. Again, he's puny. Dang. Bessie got two sick ones again. The baby has another knot. And the first one was cancer, so I'm scared not to take her. They're costing me a small fortune. I'm not well, we got to take them. I don't care. We just got to do know. it. No, I'm not going to so, let my cats go. Since now. we had that one tumor removed from her, and, it was and, and now we've discovered another one on her near her um, breast area, it's and on the front shoulder. Front shoulder, whatever you call it. And yeah. So we're going to have to take her back and find out if that knot's a cancer. David, I'm going to put cheddar, but I think I'll put the Kobe and Jack. What do you think? Why would you think that? It's stretchy. Okay. I'm not even going to use cheddar. Now, now here's another thing. What did you use before when you made it? Cheddar or whatever I had. I'm going to use the Kobe back. <laughs> Probably a long time ago. I don't even remember. Okay, look here. This is stove top. This is not, you're supposed to use breadcrumbs, buttered breadcrumbs. Whatever you got. You can toast some old bread and crumble it up and, or mash it up with.
your rolling pin and put it, anything you can do to put on top of it. You don't even need a whole layer of it. I'm just crumbling it, David. See, I'm crumbling it. You can't crumble this, but so much so it is as big as it is. It's going to be delicious with this on there. Everything you make, honey, is delicious. I share with my neighbor a lot of times. They're up in age. And hey, I, I, he, he watches the show, and I don't know if he's going to watch this or not because he's sick. And one of my best friend's brothers got cancer. It's prostate cancer, and they got it at stage four, so... Mm. He said he wasn't even hurting or, or anything, and that's why you don't never find it. No, you don't talk love. about it. Well, she's asking for prayer. I know. That's yeah. reading. Oh, okay. I, I understand. Okay. What were you telling me? I was like, don't. I don't want to, don't want to hear about that. But yeah, I understand now what you're trying to say. Yeah, Mr. Grump. No, I ain't Grump. I, we, I'm gonna name you Mr. Grump. I didn't know what she's doing. I just. Yeah, I before. would never talk about somebody's medical like that that wasn't yeah. because they wanted prior. Yeah, I, that's nothing wrong with that. I understand. Well, it's nothing I just wrong got to yak and un, I shouldn't be saying nothing. Keep that mouth, keep that trap shut. Now, you don't have to put a whole layer of this, okay? Just sprinkle some on it. Meow, Meow. what you want, Nippy? He'll come in a minute. He's out there. Meow. Mommy seen him. Mommy seen him out there. You want to go out and play with the possum? No, because she won't come back in. Liable to play with the coyote. Well, the coyote and the foxes. I, I, I don't, I'm not really too concerned with the foxes as much as I am the coyotes. Well, she's a lot smaller yeah. than the other two. Yeah. I mean, she's. I don't know if she could get away or not. The other two do. The babies. I don't know if anything much that could hold her. I know one of them birds ain't gonna dip down and get her because she's 15, 16 pounds. I 15, bet she's bigger she's than that. She's got a bad attitude. I'm going to tell you, she's never in a good mood unless she's getting what she wants. I'd like to see her chase them deers before she now gets look, bad off again. That's all I put on there. It's not a whole layer. I could put a little more, and some people might even layer it, but I never have. So, we'll make this homemade meal. I still want to do the sauerkraut. With homemade mayo. Okay, honey, we'll do the sauerkraut. What kind Tell of candy are we going to do this year? I don't know, and I thought, I thought, now I know what I was going to tell you all ago. David, um, the cannon, next time I say, David, I need tomatoes, look for me some, I got some tomatoes canned, remember? Stewed tomatoes yeah. and regular tomatoes, I got canned, and here uh -huh. I am scattering around everywhere looking for some. Well, we're getting bird brain, that's for sure, both of us. Mine, a lot of mine's medicine, and I don't know what to do about it, I mean... I really don't stop taking it. I thought uh, I forgot to ask. Well, we need to use those up so because uh, we can can some more maters this year, and that's what I mean. Remind me, instead of using the ones we bought, let's use those. You know, I got doo doo for brains. better anyway. Now you see there, there's not even a whole lot of cheese on there either. Not a whole lot of either one of those two on there. That would that looks good. Yeah. Already, yeah. Why wouldn't it look good? <laughs> My husband. Okay, Did you me... get your glasses fixed, your new glasses? No, not yet. The woman told me it'd take about a week, and I'm like, yeah, but it's killing my, my nose. And it's taking... I'm going to go back over tomorrow. It hasn't been a week, but look, everybody, how cute. They're so cute. Watch this cat. Oh, I paid a lot for them. <laughs> they hate tenfold. I paid a little bit for them, but they wasn't too bad. But, uh, but mine, I decided I couldn't afford them, so I didn't get them. So I gotta find somewhere where I can get something cheaper at for me. I just uh, I, after they tallied it all up and they said my insurance wasn't in the network. I was like, good gosh, that's a month's pay. I ain't giving that. Yeah, yes. I tell you, I paid a hundred and eighty something, and that was after what insurance paid. Still but, had to me, that's a lot. But know? see, your insurance covered it. And it's but, just like, what in the world's going around? Didn't. used to be when you bought a pair of glasses, you can't wear the glasses without the frame. They ought to come together in one price, not separate. Well, I'd say the markup on them burgers. That's just like a dryer. They don't give you a cord. Well, they don't know which thing you use. Well, we'll tell you which one we use. You give it to it with the driver. You, dryer, you can't use it without it. Shoot, the markup on them things is probably 500%. Isn't that the truth? All right, we're going to put it in there. I'm waiting on the oven there. I should have done turned it on. You ought to make that tinfoil like that, well, uh, subscriber told you about, like a tea tea. 
That was pretty cool. Yeah, but I don't need to do that. On this one, you don't? Okay. Uh-uh, because it ain't up our high enough. I remember doing that a long it's time ago. It's not real thick because it's not all the way up to the top. That was a real smart idea she gave you. I'm going to go ahead and put it in there. Even if it ain't ready, this ain't the kind of thing I really... You know I don't really have to time 350 time. on the lower level. I'll probably do it for about 30 minutes, y'all, and then we'll be right back. It's on the middle level. Okay, let's get it out. How long has it been? 30 minutes, 35, I believe. It should be o'clock, and it's 35. Look, well, it look does how smell good. Yeah, it smells good. Now, though. this is not like the chicken casserole, okay? Because in chicken casserole, you put cream of broccoli and cream of cheddar and cream of all kinds of stuff in there. Or cream of celery. Okay. Look good, don't it? Yeah. Well, let me get you some out there somehow. Let me see. I knew it popped up on one of the spoons. I don't know if I want to use spoons. These. To start with, maybe I'll use this. I'm going out there tomorrow. That woman said wait about a week, but I've done waited as long as I can. That thing's killing me. Mm. Alright. Alright, let's get some off. Now I'll learn for him, I mean. Fast. Just hold on, buddy. I think he wants a spoonful, too. I believe he's wanting some chicken out of it and probably the soup, too. Yeah, he is. Well, David, it's tearing up. But it's okay. It's what's going to do when you eat it, right? He's watching you. I know he's, he's watching. He's watching you good. You can't eat just like this, buddy. I put this out on the plate just so you can awful see skinny. what it looks like. He's skinny because he's sick. He's got a bad stomach. He's got a real bad stomach, so that's yeah, what it is. He knows he, he wants some of Brenda's vittles. He just ate some of that stuffing. <laughs> All right, honey, I know this is kind of warm, but let's see what you can do with it, okay? Can't do it with a knife. I'm trying to get a fork. It's never stopped me before. <laughs> I'll use the other hand here, I reckon, not unless you're going to feed me. I don't know. That looks awful hot. It is hot. You might want to blow on it. You want me to cool it for you? All right, honey. I'll pick you out some chicken, okay? Just wait a minute. <laughs> he loves chicken. I gave him some of the chicken mm. this morning. He knows hey, it's good. Nice. Real good. That's yeah, good. It's real good. This one's quicker than chicken casserole, so if you come in one evening and you can throw this stuff together pretty quick. Oh, you go keep eating and smacking off. It's some uh, mm. lip smacking good. That's good. Good. I'm glad. Mommy, go get you some, bud. It is I'll real make good. sure you get some chicken, okay? He says, give me yeah, some of that casserole. Chicken. Let me tell you, he loves it. Chicken everything. Lisa's oh. appetite's still good. Yeah, it is good. Even still good. Even though he's lost a lot of I weight. I don't know. It hasn't really been too good. Well, he does that sometimes. He'll lose weight, and then he'll gain it back, and it's kind of weird. I don't know how he does Honey, that. It's hot. You gotta let it cool. Here. Here. Come here. See if what you can do. I don't like to put too much on the floor there. You ain't gonna eat it? Well, then what's your problem? He wants casserole. He don't want chicken. <laughs> <laughs> well, he'll eat it. Right. Anyhow, y'all, I want to thank everybody for the gifts. I haven't sent out too many cards and stuff yet. I'm having some problems with my hands again. I, I thought you sent some cards I out. I have sent some out. But All I right, and you got a pile over there that you're working on? Yeah, I've got some I'm working on. So well, don't give up on me yet. I'm trying. I know your hands, you can't do much. So I understand. just started hurting in the thumb joints again and then the wrist. I'm like, oh, no, I don't need it right now. So I'm going to... Uh, well, I have to hire you... Uh, um, a young receptionist. Somebody cut this stuff up for me, right? Or Did you hear what I said? A young receptionist. Oh, sure. I'm sure you'd like that, wouldn't you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, I bet you are. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Yeah, I will tell y'all what. David's normally really shy when it comes to flirt with a girl or something. He couldn't flirt with me. I'd flirt with him. Yeah. It didn't make no difference. I knew he liked me, so. <laughs> well, I'm a little backwards. So are you in a, in a way like me. We both it got our backwards. When it comes to some things, I'm not backwards when it comes to running my mouth. I'll take a whole lot. Yesterday, they got me at a, at a grocery store, and I just looked at him. I said, well, guess what? Food line's just right down the road. He's like, well, ma'am, I'm sorry you feel like that. And I'm like, well, 
Why did I didn't even know it was a man? I said, why'd she tell me one thing and tell me to tell you something and come and tell you to do something else? I said, why didn't she just tell me? I can handle it. I'm an adult. Just tell me what the ad is. All right. Anyhow, it doesn't matter. Sounds too far for me to understand. When he kept running right. his mouth when I said, well, food line's just right down the road. <laughs> I don't care. That was, he, because he looked at this other guy and he well, said... Uh, everybody's stressed out anyway, you know. I know, but he looked at this other guy and, was there and he said, I knew this was going to happen today. And I'm like... So they must have thought she was coming today. I guess it's the last day of the ad and it's, they got a weird ad on the drinks. They don't know what they're doing. They're probably so. taking bids if she's going to show up today or not. No, that's not true. And, they, then, and then they people. probably say, yep, there's that woman. She showed up. I knew this but was going to... I always check myself out normally. I knew this was going to happen today. She's here. Oh, no. Everybody run the back and hide. Fast, fast, get, look. All you got to do is pick the four up and he'll run. Well, he's all right. Just leave him alone. He's hollering. I don't like to hear him holler when I'm trying to say something. All anyway, right. in, in ahead of time, so y'all won't think that I don't care. I do. I love all of you, and I sincerely appreciate all the gifts you give me. Look at here. Now, the other ones we haven't got up yet, but look here. I love these things. Why didn't I think of I it? don't know. I've never seen nothing like that, but, man, that made There's a big lazy difference. Susans, and a lot of I, times you got them in your I cabinets, know. but I got no cabinets to put them in. That's so cool. You know? On a lazy Susan. I know, and, and and you don't have to have all that junk piled no, up. No, you don't have to have it falling off everywhere, trying to take half of them down to get them, and you, I got them all pointing out. Well, half of that old exactly. stuff probably from 1995. No, it ain't. I only get what I use. It looks good that anyway, a though. Big one of the Creole, but I know some people that puts Creole in everything that they can put it in. I use one of them in the garage. All but, right. All right. Anyhow, thanks to all of you, and um, there was something else. We're going to try to get some videos going here. So I was wanting this to be too. Yeah. Sorry for one. that weird video I put on about the boots, but I got tired of waiting on you, so I thought I'd do something other. Well, I'm cleaning out the garage and getting rid of stuff. And it seems like and the more injections I get in the back, the worse it gets. I it's still just took ready the old truck, more. went to a swap meet, and sold a bunch of junk and and the boots. I just would either wear them out and throw them in the attic, just pitch them up in the attic, and figured I might need them someday. Look, well, he's got that. He's has but, everything his parents ever bought him. It's mental. I guess there's a lot of that going on in your family. <laughs> My. <laughs> My family too. It's we all got one, okay. Well, you know, we didn't have nothing this, when we was well, kids, so this, I mean, we didn't have nothing. You run around barefooted and clothes that had no holes, and I was not even not even wearing clothes. So, listen, I would like to ask for another prayer request, and and they don't know I'm going to do this, but I'm going to tell you the situation. One of my friends today let me hear a video, and it was of her niece. It was her sister's granddaughter. And that little girl was trying to commit suicide. It cut her wrist and stuff. And well, it's one of your cousins or something, isn't no, it? No, it's not my cousin. But the little girl needs prayer. She's serious about it. You ought to hear the video. It's kind of oh, it's terrible. Well, it's a horrible thing. So much of that's going on. It's just Please unbelievable. Please pray for her because, you know, I don't know. She's got a lot of it. The problem is that she's getting bullied at school. I got bullied at school too, but I went and got the biggest girls in the school to be my friends and nobody bothered me because I was small, but I was stout. So <laughs> I wasn't really afraid, but you know, it's just too much of that stuff going on in school. Sadie's been bullied and bullied and bullied, yeah. and now she's strong. Well, yeah, now she's strong, so she's learned. And now she'll knock some boy out. Oh, <laughs> I yeah. don't think they want to pick at her yeah, now. Yeah, she's done got to her. You know, and but I was like that. I was bullied too, and I was real small. I didn't weigh nothing, and, well, when and she was with but I just daddy, I just know. usually just hid off to myself, find a corner to crawl up and hide, or something. Other, but as I got older, though, it got to where I didn't give a poop. You know, Isn't that good. Though, I go back in time now. I take the biggest one in there and just knock him upside the head. <laughs> you know, we were terrible when we was young. Everybody's been through it. I'm sure if you went to school, you might have either got bullied or bullied somebody else. It's not cool. It is not cool. Children can't help. People can't help how they look. Well, God you, made us how he made us. You've got kids that are, that are like that, and it, it's a reflection on the way they was raised most of the time. And then you got the ones like us. We were raised not to fight and carry on or nothing, and then we didn't. And I so, say God bless but, everybody, but I just hate to hear a 13-year-old child talking like that. I know. It's she horrible. She's cutting her wrist and stuff, and that's so bad. I, 
know. Well, all right then. God bless everybody is what I say. I love everybody. And I just wish I know. people would quit being so mean. It's yeah. not good. I know. Where we love all of you. Please, please pray for this little girl too. I don't know what her name is, but God does. Well, we're in them times, so this this is we'll have to see some weird stuff probably. That's right. So anyway, well, just keep on keep on getting it. Keep on and keeping on, all right? Yeah, and just try to do the best you can. That's all you can do. That's right. Okay, you all. We'll see you soon. We're gonna get another one going tomorrow. All right. And that is good. Give it a try. Bye.